The Motorcycle Monster is brought to you by the MRA. Whether it's motorcycle insurance, roadside assistance, or motorcycle training, the MRA can save you hundreds. Remember, help is on the way with MRA. As the popularity of choppers and custom-built motorcycles evolve, new builders are coming into the custom scene daily. One renowned Tampa painter gone builder is Eric Warren. Eric Warren started working on automobiles in Miami 15 years ago. His focus was custom cars and killer paint jobs. As the custom motorcycle world began to explode, Eric began to turn his attention to motorcycles. He used to be into painting down there. And uh, when that car scene of paintwork started to go out, the bikes started coming in and uh, got into bikes, painting bikes about 15, 16 years ago, and it just kind of led up from there. After that, I started welding on motorcycles and stuff like that and getting more and more into them until it started becoming full builds and stuff like that, and here we are. After a move to Tampa, Eric changed his direction completely and became one of the most popular motorcycle painters in Florida. With help from his brother, Kurt, and lots of hard work, Eric began to build his business. And he said, quit your job, come run my company, and let's go from there. That was, I'd say, about three years ago now, and we've just been moving forward ever since. Went from working out of his garage, uh, we got into the bike building part of it, and then took what I know with the retail end of doing retail management for so long, and started it with a store side, and we've gone from there. Recently, his fabrication work has become the primary focus. Mostly what we do now is we concentrate on ground up builds, you know, and, and fabrication and stuff like that. Um, I got started in the paint work, so that's always going to be something I, I pride myself on. But we're actually trying to get out of doing, you know, the, the paint repairs and, and the repaints and stuff like that of other people's bikes. We're trying to concentrate on just custom built bikes and, you know, high end paint work, stuff that's really going to, you know, get our name out there right now and get us noticed. Eric Warren Designs now fabricates most components for the ground-up build. With a manufacturing license, his ability to sell this creation is much improved. This actually got our manufacturer's license, so we get to title our own bikes now as EWD Cycles. You know, we tag them, we're, we're financeable now, so that right there is, is big news for us. So hopefully that'll give us a chance to be able to sell more bikes and get more of our products out there and get, get noticed a little bit more. As Eric has received more attention at shows and through motorcycle publications, his star seems to be rising. Eric has set his goals high and hopes for bigger and better things. The popularity of the new motorcycle TV show has helped everyone in the business, according to Warren. I think, you know, all this TV stuff, you know, Discovery Channel and, you know, all the national magazines, how they're covering everything, I think it's great. It just does nothing but, you know, help our industry big time. I mean, it's, it's amazing to see where the industry is now compared to, you know, 5, 10, 15 years ago when I first got into this business. It's just, it's amazing. The sky's the limit right now. Eric enjoys working and collaborating with Brother Kurt. Eric Warren Designs is diverse in their thinking and build many styles of motorcycle. One thing we try to do here is not stick to a style. Uh, we've got you know several styles that we do here. You know we do bobbers, you know the old schools. We do pro streets. We do choppers. And I don't want to stick to any one style. I want to do a whole bunch of different things. And I think that's what keeps things fresh around here. Keeps the ball rolling. Eric also gets extremely creative at times. He even has built a custom chopper with a TV screen. The Hellvision bike is uh, you know, one of our newer choppers. Why can't we put TVs on a motorcycle, you know, and put, uh, make it so it plays video? So that's how we built that. I had to hand make the Maltese gas tank for it. And then we put a, an automotive DVD player underneath the transmission on it. And, you know, here we are. You can drive down the street and play the TVs on it. And it's more for shock value than anything, but the bike rides, the TVs play just fine, and it's even got speakers on it, so it's pretty cool to see going down the road. Eric loves what he does and the excitement of the motorcycle world. What's in the future for Eric Warren Designs? I can come in every day, I've got a smile on my face, and I leave every day with a smile on my face. I can get on my bike, ride home, and I just feel free doing it. So I love it, plan on doing it hopefully the rest of my life. A dream scenario, I guess, to make it big, you know, like these guys on TV are making it, you know. That would, you know, kind of help out with, you know, the notoriety, the fame, the, the money, everything. I mean, that would kind of be the, the icing on the cake. 
The signs all seem to point in the same direction, and all indications are Eric Warren Designs will continue to grow, and we haven't heard the last of Eric Warren. This is Dan Derringer reporting from Tampa and Eric Warren Designs.